Right, welcome back. Camper van storage right is always an asshole. There's never anywhere to put anything. So I bought some upgrades. These bad boys. Banda Moon. Polish company. And they do all sorts of doing moon boxes and all that stuff, which if I started this conversion now and I knew about Van der Moon, I would have done the moon boxes because they're just a lot better than wood and it's a lot lighter. You know my van's a bit of a fat cow. So we'll put some more bits in it. What I've ordered is the Moon Organizer Max. Basically that's just gonna go the full length of my door here. Now you might think, oh you got a window there, what do you want to plug your window up for? We never use the bloody windows. You don't even look out of them. The only one she looks out at, the missus is the one on that side and that's got a Voyager Vans thermal cover on it, magnetic, another good product. And we normally have this up all the time, so this is gonna go on here. So you got one for the bottom on there, so that'll fit on that bit there. And then the next one, should have put some clamps on these wheels, shall I? And the next one is gonna go up there, so that's gonna cover the wind a bit there. So if I hold that, see if we can jiggle my hands, be like that. And you'll see the amount of storage that opens up with. You can fit all sorts of shite in. But let me work out how I'm going to mount the bloody thing. So we'll be taking that panel off for a start. Let's go and get some tools and see if we can butcher this. First plan of action is get that bottom panel off. A trim tool on it. Jesus Christ. These them start, uh, them tree things I used. And they go in deep. Cracking trim clips, especially when you put carpet on and all that stuff. So you see how prickly them things are. Look at them. Crackers them. <sighs> Waste time carpet in that one, it. So you see a lot of people cut all this out, and I understand why. Like, because when you try and trim clip it, you need bloody longer clips, and but that's to insulation, doesn't it? Plastic wrapper off. Right. So for this, it says for mounting it, a soldering iron, and you just pierce and all where the mounting point's gonna be. So I think we'll have one, two, three. So we'll do three along the top, three down the side, one, two on that one, and then down there. So let's have a look where it lines up. See what it's like on bodywork. See in this bottom corner here, I was gonna put an hole in that, but it's a good job I checked it then because the bodywork actually goes in there, it doesn't come out till about here. So it'll be a hole here, all here. Go off, go and get a clamp, Anna. Tell you what, that wind, I tell you, it's either lashing down, windy, or it's snowy. Right, let's get his top bit on to this, lined up to roughly, so it looks straight. And that will go on there like that. But I'm a bit conscious because where the wind is, you've not got enough meat behind the panel there. Because you're following contour of van. There's a lip on this side here, if you're following that, that one there. Oh shit. Up to there. Which fits in snug, but you're not got enough meat on it. Blue pen for a blue van. Got key theme going, aren't you? That there should be level to where I need it. Have a nose to see what it like. So roughly what I've done there is I've just marked up where I'm gonna put the holes. And I think that should be strong enough for it. Don't know whether to put one in the middle there or do we need it? I think it might be stronger for that. I think it's just the outside should be fine on that one. So if this top panel, same again on this one. So I want all there. I need to find out where the window is. So the window's there. Up to here. And then the next one is here. Same this side. Just to try and get the line these up. Oh, there's a window. All right, that's a recess bit. So roughly there. And then the top bit. Need some longer leg stones. Clamps go on everything, usual. I would have said that'd be ample for all of that. Right, let's chat, Baz. Let's get them on. Right, let's get the egg jackery out. So, it's a soldering iron on here. So, let's try it on this head bit first. So, don't fuck it up. Right, so let's just poke the hole into it. So, that's all holes put in there, which thing, it just gives a cleaner finish. If we put this back up here, with Max work. I mean, you have to check them about 15 times, make sure it's all lined up. Now, for fitting these right, you can either use M5 riv nuts, so you have to drill all the bodywork out, put riv nuts in, and then bolt it if you want to, or you can use 
normal rivets but I think when you put a rivet in it's solid then you're never going to take it off and because I've got a window behind it I want to be able to take it off but I'm not putting tons of rib nuts in the van so I'm going to use self tappers on this make sure you've got this in the right place and then I'm going to drill the pilot some bad boys in it little self tappers and what I'm going to do on these I'm going to get a plastic cap in fact I'm going to pick it up now actually point is doing half a job in it so basically self tapper through that, put cap on, jobs are got done. And if you need to take the panel off, I can just unscrew it. I just showed you a cap, right? I forgot to put a cap on myself. Fucking idiots. Oh shit, they're bad. So it's all like that. Right, I'll not bore you now. I'll whiz it round, get them all done, and get on to the top. That's the bottom one on there. It's looking quite nice, isn't it, really? I mean, you, didn't, you don't really need the top bit with that. There's tons of storage on it, but I think we'll crack on. We'll get the other bit done, and then um, she will be complete. So there we have it. The Van der Moon Max Organizer. Mint, it? Got loads of clips on it here. Hanging random shit on, whatever you want to hang on. Plenty of bags. I like these pouches as well, these are quite good. Got a fair bit in them. They're also press studded I've designed as well. Which is quite good, so you get quite a depth on that as well. That's a cool touch. So you're never going to be stuck for storage really. There's absolutely tons of stuff on it. It's more shite in the van to put in. Gotta admit though, it looks good, doesn't it? That's me skint again. See you on the next mod.